Welcome back, everybody. This is VC Diesel from Wild Boys Inc. We got another box of the Tops Opening Day 2021s. Looking for the autographs and the relics. We also have over here that sweet Diamond Kings baseball blaster box, and that one's gonna be fire. That'll be coming up soon. Stay tuned, and let's get this underway so we can check out what we get here. Give this box another shot. Before I become a soul believer in those Diamond Kings. Let's see what we do here. Because this was pretty good last time. A lot of packs. A lot of fun. Clean cards. Surprises. Who knows. Here we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 packs. And we're empty in the box. Let's see how it goes. Right into the trash bag. Let's do it. Get right down to business. Remember, I'm going to just go through them. I'm not show you the backs unless we hit like a relic or something crazy. And then continue on. I just leave all of my cards so they stay in perfect condition. Eventually, we'll have the website up. And if you see something you like, go check it out. First up, we got Brandon Crawford, San Fran. Next up, we got D. Strange Gordon, Mariners. Don't know how you can breathe playing a sport like that. That is not advised, by the way, to do that. Next, we got rookie card Daniel Johnson, Indians. Tell you, I like their old uniforms the best. And we got a mascot card. We got Mr. Fred Bird, St. Louis. Fred Bird. Hilarious. Next up, Nick Niedert. Rookie card. Horizontal. Lateral. I understand sometimes. Go to your home. Nice. Next up, Phillies, JT, Real Muto. That's our catcher. One of them. And then we got Matt Chapman, A's. Right into the next pack. Waiting to find an autograph in here. We got an autograph in our first Legends Diamond Kings baseball before. All right, we got a little something, something coming. Next up, Reds, Trevor Bauer. Looking like he's throwing almost like a knuckle. Curves come from that sidearm. Three quarter. Next up, Yon Mancada, White Sox. Then we get some Royals action here with Chris Bubik. Southpaw, rookie card. And we got a future stars, Gavin Lux, with his eyes shut. And 
And we got Ozzy Albiaz. Really looking like he's going there, man. And then we got Xander Bogarts hopping in the air. Second time I've seen this one. It's your Red Sox. And then we got. Can't get that under. So we get the all time great Hank Aaron. Wow. Hank Aaron. Aaron ripped 19 career hits in opening day games, including three in 1959, but none was more satisfying than the one that came on his first swing of the 1974 campaign on April 4th in Cincinnati. After waiting all offseason to resume his pursuit of Babe Ruth, Hank cranked home run number 714 to tie the Bambino's career record. Woo! Awesome. I think we got a relic. So we do. First up, Max Kepler. Then we got Roughened Odor. Smells clean. That's your Texas. And we're coming back to Oakland with Matt Olson. And then we got Trevor Story, Georgia, Colorado. Tail Scar Hernandez. His arm's looking wild. Blue Jays. And then we got Willie Adams, Rays. I do not want to block out Hank Aaron here, but we are coming into... Our last card here. And who we got here? Stop it. Don't want to block the guy out. We get a legend relic card. Legends of Baseball. Hank Aaron. Stop it. Phenomenal. It's a beautiful picture of the guy. Hank averaged 37 homers and 113 RBIs per 162 games played over his 23-year Hall of Fame career. The 1957 NL MVP award recipient won three awards for his outfield defense and led the circuit in slugging four times in three different decades. Aaron's 6,856 total bases remained the all-time standard. Guy is like the legend. The guy. Look at that. When do you ever get two Hank Aaron cards? Awesome. I don't know if I'll ever give those away. All right, cleaning up. So we could open the next three. Looks like the keyboard could hold about three, three packs. We'll leave our big boys in the back here, just for the time being.
Imagine a Hank Aaron autograph card. I'll go ballistic. First up, Jock Peterson. Then we got Ronald Acuna Jr. Diving. Another diving. David Dahl. Three in a row on the laterals. We're coming back with Justin Upton. Angels. And we go to the Rockies for the Dinger. I don't even want to put that up there. It's stupid. Putting it to the side. We got the Astros. Boop. Zach Grinky. Grink. I put the E at the end if you don't want to hear it. And then we got Jesse Aguilar, Miami. Oh, Jesus, Aguilar. Sorry, guys. I read that too quick. Doesn't look like a, like a Jesse, really. He looks like a Jesus. Hey, Zeus. I don't know why I read it that quick like that, but it's kind of funny. Oh, let's go here. We got something. We got one of those blue prisms. First up, Bale Burrows on the rookie. Detroit. Bale! Next, we got a Futures Stars, Adrian Morjan. And then we're going to the Reds, Joey Votto. And then we got Bo Bichette, Future Stars, Blue Jays, Bo Bichette, sounding like a Star Wars bounty hunter. It's nice. And then we got Lorenzo Cain, the Brewers. Before we check out that blue prism, we got the reds on the opening day. Team card. Now let's see what this is. It's Houston Astros, George Springer. On that April 1st, 2021 card. The hollow. Blue hollow. Mahalo. Boom. It's one. Let's keep it going. Starting to heat up. All 
All right, so we get a relic. Another horizontal. Dane Dunning, rookie card. <laughs> Looks like he's throwing the ball at the cameraman. Going to the Royals. Salvador Perez. And we're going to the Dodgers with Kalebert Ruiz, rookie card. Kalebert Ruiz. Love rookies. Because you never know. Chris Bryant, Cubs, next. Wearing a mitten. And we got two horizontals. Paul Goldschmidt, St. Louis. Goldschmidt. Oh, boy. I already seen the name. And we got Humberto Meja. Rookie card, Arizona. And then we're getting that relic. You guys ready? Here we go. Never want to know who that is? Legends of Baseball. One of my favorites. One of the best video games back in the day. Cal Ripken Jr. Awesome. This guy's a legend. Baltimore. Exalted for his Iron Man streak of 2,632 games played. Cal also was at his best when it mattered most. He batted a 336 in 28 career postseason contests, leading the Orioles to a World Series title during his first AL MVP season of 1983. He's one of six players with 3,000 hits, 600 doubles, and 400 homers. Awesome. Cal Ripken Jr. Nice card. All right, let me clean the board. All these uh, horizontals. Put Cal up in the back with the other greats. Oh, we got a congratulations. An actual relic card, not a made up one. But we are going to go like this. And we're going to keep it moving. Kyle Seeger, Mariners. I mean, I call those relic cards because they're legends of baseball. You know, it's like a relic player, but it's not an official congratulatory relic card. Next up, we got Nick Senzel, opening day. Boom. But I think we're about to be pleasantly surprised. I don't know what it is. All I saw was congrats. And that I haven't seen in a while. Wow. Nick Madrigal. Madrigal. <laughs> for shizzle, manizzle, madriggle, Nick, rookie card. Don't care, Nick. Next up, shocking, Hank Aaron, Legends of Baseball, on a self-proclaimed what I call a relic card, and he's right there. I put him in his own sleeve anyway. Same story. 
Yep. What are the odds of that? One pack and two, three Hank Aaron cards. And then we got, congratulations. You have just received an opening day relic card from the 2020 opening day baseball. This relic contains in this card is not from a specific game, event, or season. Glaber Torres Yankees. Look at that. Piece of the Yanks uniform. That's special. Now, excuse me while I put this in this here case. A sleeve, I should say. That's nice right there. Look at that. Glaber in the house. Woo! Let's get some more of those. Heating up or what? Mitch White, Dodgers rookie card. So the opening days, would I get them again? Hell yes. I'm all in. Next we got Javier Baez. Baez. Cubs. I need some water. Excuse me for one second. All right, let's get back down. Then we got Pete Alonzo, Mets. And then we're going Tony the Tiger, Detroit. Pause. Stupid. Put a mask on a mascot. Let's get out of here with the shit. Next. Miguel Sano. Twins. Giving you the old dirty. See which way the wind's blowing. I can tell you which way it's blowing. And then we got Letty Tavares with the bat floating again. We've seen that one. And that's a rookie card. And then we got a Yankee, Glaber Torres. That is awesome. Those will stick together. So back to back packs, we get Torres here from the New York Yankees. It's going right up here with his memorabilia card. We're still waiting on the ever elusive autograph card. Let's just put this one right out in front because I don't really like these. Opening day Mets. Steven Strasburg, Washington. We get the other lateral. Future stars, James Kurenchak. It's pretty cool making it to the big leagues. Those are your Indians. Next up, Chris Sal. Red Sox.
And we got Jordan Alvarez. Astros. And Miguel Rojas. Marlins. And last but not least, a rookie, Spencer Howard, Phillies. Let me clean it up. We got two packs left. All right, we're coming down to the nitty gritty here. We got two packs left. Do we got something special in one of these? Another special something? Definitely got something in here. So it's gonna be one of those relics, or my fake relic cards that I like to say, the legends of baseball I've seen. So let's continue. Mark Kana. Ace. And we're going to the Reds with Aristides Aquino, Future Stars. Hope I don't butcher these guys' names too much. Sometimes it ain't easy. And we got the White Sox, Jose Abreu. What else? Justin Turner on that horizontal, looking like a Viking. Abba, if you guys seen The Last Kingdom, awesome show on Netflix. Go check it out, you'll know who I'm talking about. And we got the Atlanta Braves, Marcel Ozuna. Got it. And then we got Andres Jimenez, Mets, Jimenez, rookie card. And then we're going to have our Legends of Baseball, Ted Williams, Red Sox. Let's check him out. Ted, who secured six AL batting titles, easily could have had eight. In 1949, he finished just .002 behind George Kell of Detroit. Five years later, he raked in a league's best of 345, but walked so often that he didn't have enough at-bats to qualify. His dozen OBP crowns led to an all-time career mark of 482. Nice. Another legend. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Here we go. Justin Dunn, Mariners. Shane Bieber, horrible last name. And then we got Walker Bueller. Hmm. 
<laughs> Kettle Marte, Arizona. Cattell Marte. This friggin' guy, Mr. Red. Stupid. I mean, I guess if you're collecting them, it's cool, but no thanks. Not me. And we got Royals. Jorge Soler. And last but not least, Detroit Casey Mize. Rookie. So, guys, thank you. Remember to like, share, subscribe, comment, subscribe, subscribe, and subscribe. I uh, will bring you this one next out of the baseball. Thank you guys for watching and listening to me mispronounce names. I appreciate it. We got some cool stuff. Check this out. It's a nice relic card. And I uh, appreciate you guys being here. So, thank you again. VC Diesel, Wild Boys Inc. I'm out.